What up dogs? Welcome back to Rad Resells. In today's video, it's actually going to be from yesterday. We went thrifting and we visited three stores. So one Goodwill, one Ross, and one local thrift store that we had never been to before. So if you're interested in seeing what we found and what we gave up, and uh, basically I have mixed feelings about it, maybe we should have bought it after all. Stay tuned and let's get into the video. So first stop, of course, Goodwill. Pro tip, always look for the new racks first. <laughs> okay. After we have hit up the new racks, we start to go through the regular aisles of clothing. Also, don't neglect the shoes that you see on top of every rack. Uh, we find a lot of shoes here, and this is a pair of Morel Vibram. I don't really know how you say that, but we should get about $25, $30 for them. Then we saw a new rack come out, and we immediately hit it up. There wasn't much on it, unfortunately, but I did find this Jordan um, zip-up, what do you call it, track jacket, and a pullover. So we decided to pick them up. Not sure how much we can get for them, but give them a chance. Call us inspirational. New inside plastic. We finished up at Goodwill and headed over to Ross. What the hell? So Dr. Martens are obviously a very good brand and something to be on the lookout for, but there were only two comps available that were sold and they were taking offers, so we didn't see it worth it for $50. And so we walked away with nothing from Ross. But then we went over to the thrift store that we have never been to, so we were really excited about this place. You won't believe what we found. So many Ed Hardy shirts. Like these are absolutely insane. Are we seeing the graphics on these? I was blown away. Like how are there so many Ed Hardys here? I found Ed Hardy twice, two pants, and they sold for $80 and $120. Uh, so I was very happy with these. However, they were kind of pricey. They were ranging from $7 and they had stains on them to $25. Like what? But after looking up the comps, although there is over 100% sale through rate, we decided not to get any of these uh, for multiple reasons but I'm not really sure if we made the right call looking back at it. This Russell Athletic vintage jersey would have been a nice find. I was pretty stoked about it until I looked at the price tag. Hold on, hold on, look at this. $11, no thank you. On a scale from 1 to 10, how would you rate our Thursday? 2.5. I was going to say 3. <laughs> so overall, it wasn't the best trip, but hey, you can't hit the Hail Mary every time. And I'll see you guys next time.